Good morning. Happy Tuesday. I just recorded a video on this and, and I decided not to put it up because I get a little heated. Um, it frustrates me that there are so many attorneys out there who are more concerned about their, their appearance, their public perception than about doing what's right, not just for the community at large, but, you know, for potential clients. Giving out bad advice, saying stupid shit, saying stupid shit like, uh, yes, it is a crime to solicit, it is a crime to solicit the crime of trespass, or soliciting any crime, including trespass, is a crime. I believe that was the way it was phrased. Our, our, our dear friend Michael Eline, the, uh, the all hat, no cattle, um, as Josh Stone Vet likes to call him, boot, the dumb boot, the boot. That's what, that's what he phrased his last video. He is so concerned about trying to look right, trying to upstage a first year family law attorney who looks like this. I mean, what, like, why are you trying to compete with me, bro? Like, look at me. Do I, do I look anything special? Do I, do I LARP as a Marine and show off my firearms on camera? You know? I sit in my fucking car and talk shit, dude. Anyway, so this dumbass Michael Eline puts out this video. I haven't watched the video. I don't really care. The title itself is misleading. And so I just want to address this. I am a first year family law attorney out of California. I'm only licensed to practice in California. And Michael Eline is not a first year family law attorney. He's been practicing law longer than I have. Uh, he primarily does personal injury. He has done some other things. He's, he's a, uh, the attorney of record on some uh, published court of appeals decisions. <clears throat> that doesn't really mean anything though, just FYI. Um, Cause it doesn't mean he did any of the pleadings involved. It just means that he was the attorney of record. I mean, we've seen in other pleadings where, you know, the attorney of record is this guy and then there's somebody else's name underneath it. And the person who's, whose name is underneath it has done all the fucking work. And the other guy maybe goes and does an oral argument. Maybe if that, so, so take it all with a grain of salt, you know, but I, as a first year family law attorney, not licensed to practice in Texas can tell you unequivocally that the crime of criminal conspiracy only applies to crimes that would be a capital offense, capital felony, or a first degree felony. Very serious things. First degree felonies would be like aggravated robbery, uh, attempted murder, things like that. Uh, so criminal trespass in Texas is not a capital felony, nor is it a first degree felony. I, I think, I think it might be like a, a very low level felony at worst, but generally it's going to be a misdemeanor. It's certainly nothing that you can be convicted of criminal conspiracy to commit trespass in Texas. So Michael, Michael Eline, who is licensed to practice in California and Texas, doesn't understand Texas law as far as criminal solicitation is concerned. Think about that for a minute. This man is getting on YouTube and making blanket statements completely unconcerned with how people in this community, in his community, that he's courting are going to understand it or misunderstand it and misapply it. Completely unconcerned with some poor bastard out there who's going to say, you know, an attorney on YouTube said that soliciting a trespass is a crime. Misunderstanding the nuance that Michael Eline had to put into it by slipping in criminal trespass or the crime of trespass And making a blanket statement that's just wrong, it might not even apply. Even soliciting the crime of trespass, i.e. asking you to go trespass on someone else's property in return for money or something along those lines, may or may not be a crime. It's not a crime in Nevada where, where Chile did it that, that raised this whole specter. It's not a crime in Texas where Eline is licensed to practice. Why does a first year family law attorney have to point this out, Michael Eline, who's not even licensed in Texas? Make a fucking video where you try to weasel your way out of this.
you slimy fucking snake. He's gonna he's gonna play around with he's gonna try to he's gonna try to change what he actually meant. Well, it actually meant uh, you made the blanket statement, motherfucker. There's screenshots of it in my Discord, not taken by me. I don't watch your stupid shit because you're a fucking idiot. But people in my channel like to watch your shit and laugh at you. They fucking laugh at you. Non-attorneys in my channel, in my Discord channel, you said something along the lines of uh, you were gonna sue people for defamation and, and slander. And they're like, well, is it slander defamation? Shouldn't he say is it, he's going to sue him for libel and slander? Non-attorneys. Non-attorneys know more about defamation than you do, Michael. Dumb shit. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.